Hello everyone. I'm going to show you how to use the Retainer Invoice widget from the Inquiries module. We use the Retainer Invoice widget to collect a prepayment or deposit on a new sales opportunity. So here's an inquiry I've already prepared that's sitting on Quote Sent. I'm going to click on Quote Approved. I can pop in a customer order number if I have one. I'm going to determine the next steps under the approval type. So I'm going to select Create Retainer Invoice. I'm going to say payment is due immediately. I'm going to pop a comment in here to say that we require a $500 deposit. I click on save. And I jump straight to quote retainer invoice requested. So now when I click on create retainer invoice, it now opens up my widget and I can pop in my invoice requirements. So I'm going to pop in, I want a fixed amount and I want $500. It's picked up that it's due immediately. I can type in here anything I want. I'm going to type deposit payment. I can pop in a product description if I want to. So I'm just going to write um, deposit for services provided and choose the tax. Now I can also tick on to send invoice immediately or I can untick this and have the accounts team check it first. Now up here I had a couple of other options. I could have chosen a percentage of the quote or I could have said claim the balance of the quote if I've already raised other invoices. If I didn't have a quote on this inquiry, this option here and this option would be disabled. So if I click on create my retainer invoice, that automatically takes me to the invoice module. And there we go. The invoice has been created. The status reflects that accounts need to send it. It says here that it's a retainer invoice. And you can see here that this is going to go to my balance sheet. If we come down, you can see that's been associated with the deposit product with the description that I entered. I can now proceed with sending this to my client. And if I'm using Zoho Books, it'll sync to my accounting system. If I'm using Xero, it won't sync to the accounting system, but it will reconcile to the prepayment when you do your bank reconciliation.